King Carter, King Carter, King Carter, I buy King Carter, King Carter. Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I'm bringing you guys the start of Act 2. Oh man, we're about to get it down. We've been moving along progressively. Uh, I got the game at 12 a.m. on Tuesday. And uh, for me to be in on episode 10, it's pretty good, man. I got a busy schedule, kids. I gave you guys a full game for NBA 2K14, my career playoffs. Oh, man, it's, it's just wild. But uh, like I said before, man, I thank everybody for the support on this Watchdog series. I didn't even notify anybody that I was coming out with this series. So, again, thank you. But, um... So far, the game is pretty good. I wanted to rev up a little bit more. What I'm going to do is um, I'm actually going to be killing people more. Yeah, man. Um, not, not so much funny moments, but more when I'm doing the missions. I'm going to X out everybody. Any fixer can get it. That's basically how I'm going to look at it. So I'm going to go to the nearest gun shop. I'm going to spend all of my money on guns. And I'm just going to be that guy that just doesn't care about anybody. Straight up. <laughs> But um, let me get my cool walk on real quick. Hold up, the phone's ringing. Hold on. Aiden, we had a very unpleasant meeting. Well, I didn't kill you. We used to get along. I taught you so much. Look at you, big time hacker now. Is that you in the news? The vigilante? You mentioned a second hacker at the Merlot job. But we already knew there was another hacker. You found something new. Ah, intriguing, isn't it? Come. Let's meet and I'll explain. Tell me. Then I'll consider meeting. Oh, no. My information, my rules. Besides, we need to make up for last time. I'm very excited, Aiden. Come soon. All right. So, for this guy to be a tech-savvy, you know, next-generation hacker, why don't my man got a Bluetooth, though? That's, that's all I'm saying. Why don't he got a Bluetooth? You know what I'm saying? At least got some wireless beats by Dre's on or something. Man, hold on. Let me see something. I can't go there. Alright, I'll go here. Now, I'm going to try to make this ride as short as possible, which means I'm going to be running all lights. I'm going to be messing with traffic signals. I am going to be acting a fool. Alright, and I did not pick the right car for this occasion, but it's cool. Now, uh, one thing I will say, the driving in this game, some cars are perfect for this game, and others are just terrible. Like, um, for instance, I think I was driving like uh, a little Camaro type looking joint. The controls on that bad boy be sticking something fierce. But uh, I was driving something like a Ferrari. And I'm going to tell you now, the drifting that I could do in that car was amazing. Like, I was I was really liking that car. But um, one big thing that's pissing me off, I don't have a garage. Now, I know I can order any car that I want, but I got to pay for it. But why do I have to do that every time I get the car? Like, why can't I just buy the car one time and then if I order it, it'll just, you know, magically appear in my driveway for free? Like, that's all I'm asking. Look at that billboard, by the way. Yeah, man, I be looking at the cars in this game. Hold up, breaking news. Known as digital trips, these mind-altering experiences have hit the streets of Chicago. They're believed to change people's perceptions of the world around them. Though they're technically legal, don't expect that to last for long. City officials are investigating and may push for a bylaw restricting these digital adventures. Okay, well, seeing as though they put this in the game, they're not going to be restricting anything. <laughs> <laughs> Ubisoft ain't going for that. <laughs> we gonna get our mind altering objectives on. Hold on, I see a gun store. Hold up though, hold up though. Let me go up in this gun store real quick. You know what I'm saying? I climb over cars. Ain't nobody got time for that. Alright. Let's shop, baby, let's shop. Alright, first. How you doing? I'm doing pretty good, bro. I'm doing pretty good. What is it you're looking for today? Um, right now, I'm just looking for, you know, something nice. Let's see. All right, AK-47 got three stars. The Goblin. It's a burst fire. Oh, look at that ACR, though. I'm saying, though. Let me get that. Let me get that. Yeah, let me get that. Um, Pistols. 
I got the Spec Ops joint. That joint like a three. But this joint right here is semi-auto revolver. I don't know if I could do a revolver. Well, nah, let me go to SMGs. Nah, I got a sniper rifle. I might need a sniper rifle one day. How much that cost? 45 grand. Okay. All right, so let me equip this real quick. See how much uh, ammo I got. Come back anytime. I got 360 joints. All right. Easy, easy, man. So, let me get back in my wheel. I'm going to be rocking with an ACR. I'm in my Call of Duty bag. You know what I'm saying? I wish I would have sleight of hand on this bad boy, but it's cool. It's cool. But uh, where am I going? Okay. Why do I have to go all the way around this way? Okay. Where am I going? My waypoint put me right here, but... Let me get over here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. All right, I'm going to get out. I'm going to stop being lazy. Can you do that? Yes, sir. I can do whatever I want. Hold on, kiddo. That's the name of this mission. Okay. All right, I'm going to shut up now so you guys can hear the little cutscenes. I need to make this quick. Damien's pride is his weak spot. Just... Play it up. Convince him to say what he knows. Then drop him. He's too reckless. He's too dangerous. Phone ringing. Where are you? I don't think you're gonna like my answer. You know what? Forget it. I don't need whatever you got. You brought me nothing but trouble. We're done talking. Oh, too late, Aiden. <laughs> you won't believe where I am. Never mind, I'll send you the feed. Find a TV and have a look. That's Nikki's house. What are you doing? You should hurry, my boy. Your pretty sister needs you. Damien! Uh-oh. That's not good. Damien, what are you doing? All right, let me set the waypoint first. I need to break into that CTOS joint, though. Yo, for me to have unlimited sprint, I'll be moving slow. <laughs> oh, I see a coop. Let me look both ways, make sure I don't get hit. Huh, you hear that? Like, I got keys to the bitch. Oh, oh, this one is fierce. But I'm gonna get there real soon, though. Watch me work. Watch me work. Played me. That son of a bitch Damn. played me, and I let him. What's he doing? No, he won't hurt them. I'll kill him if he touches them. No, he has to know that. No, he's trying to draw me there. He wants me to work with him. Find the guys who attacked us. Fuck that. I need to take him down. Oh, Drift King. Oh, my God. Okay, they're injured, but they're not dead. That's cool. Just hang in there, guys. I'm coming. Oh, snap. I jumped out the car and injured my own self trying to get hit. Good God, I love her. Six years old. It's tragic. Where are they? Such a waste. All of this, it's such a waste. You know, the real tragedy here is that somebody like you was surrounded by so many fragile things. It makes you fragile. Where? That's not how it works. You don't want to answer that. Yeah. Nikki, where are you? <laughs> Nikki! Ah, stop and think. You fuck around and she's dead. D! 
This isn't how I wanted it. But this is where we are. If you'd listen to me, things would be different. Just tell me where they are. Where they are? There's only Nikki. That little boy. I don't know where he is. Now this is what's gonna happen. That points to a hard drive. I told you there was another hacker. That will lead you to his computer. Get it? And you'll find out who ordered the hit on us. What do you really want? You lost your right to question me. I want that hard drive. That's all you need to know. And that's the price for Nikki. Stop overthinking, Aiden. We'll need regular updates. In exchange, you get to talk to Sis. Quit pro and all that. This won't end well for you. Perhaps, but don't get clever. I really have no problem killing that girl. We'll talk soon, partner. Don't cry, Aiden. Where is Jax? Damien doesn't have him. I hope he's got his tablet. There. He's on the L. Oh shit, someone's after him. Oh god. There you are. I was worried. The dead sack hacks you gave me. Can I control the L? The train? Yeah, but... I need that right now. How do I do it? It's locked. Hold on. I'm sending something. It's a zero-day exploit. The trains won't recognize the hack, but it only works once. Send it now. It's sent. What happened, Aiden? I don't have time. Meet me at the Al Motel later, okay? Uh-oh. The boy almost went the wrong way. Fuck. Okay. I don't get no helmet or nothing. Oh God. I'm here, man. Dang. I can't reach him in time. Right, hack the tree. Get Jackson moving and away from these guys. This hack, baby. Check every car. Kids here somewhere. Here. All right, that's bought me time. I can make the next station. Hold on, kiddo. Train's leaving. Shit. All right, get to the next station. Go. Go. <laughs> Somebody's on us. Who is this guy? Try to ditch him if you can. Let's go. We have an open contract. Any takers? I'm on it. <gasps> Run him off the road. I got him. Don't worry. He ain't, he's not going to escape on my watch. Sitting here in this goddamn shit. Hold on. I need a car. He's on foot. This is our chance. Hit him. No, I need some cover. Oh. 
Oh my god. I love this game. Oh fuck this. Just go. <laughs> you might not want to do that. I'm nice with the whip game, baby. Come on, I'm trying to neutralize. Whew. Come on, almost there. Vehicle's dead. Keep after him. I'll be okay. Uh oh. Got another body. He's down. All right. Let me go ahead and get over to this train, though. How the heck am I going to find this train? Hold up. I don't need no waypoint, baby. Whip game vicious. Y'all got the best whip game in the city. That's what I do. Woo, I'm on. Jax. You're safe now. All right, you're safe. Okay, listen. This is important. Back at the house, did you hear those men say anything? Come on, Jax, talk to me. All right. We're gonna find your mom. Come on. Dr. Mendez speaking? Yolanda, hi. This is Aiden Pierce, Nikki's brother. Is everything all right? It'd be great if we could meet in person. I'm on the train with Jax. All right. Uh, do you know where Nikki drops him off? Yeah, we'll meet you there. Mm -hmm. I need you to be brave for me, okay? Men at the house said this. This is good, Jax. It's good. Well, would you look at that? He actually did something good for a chance. Hey! Hello, sweetheart. What's going on, Mr. Pierce? Where's Nikki? Nah, it's been a rough week. She's forced herself to get rid of Lena's stuff, and uh, I think she's finally saying her goodbyes. How bad is it? It's bad. She should call me. Well, she wanted me to call you. See, we we're wondering if you could look after Jax for a few days. We'll pay you, of course. Of course. I'll help in any way I can. That'd be great. Thank you. Nikki needs to grieve. I know it's hard, but it's a good thing. It's been rough. We're gonna work it out. Right? Hey, little man. We're gonna cause some trouble. Uh, let's go. Go. Is it over? Train arriving shortly. Is the cutscenes over? Let me get ghosts. All right, complete it. All right, you guys. Arriving shortly. I'm about to go on ahead, head to the next mission. Um, trying to figure out. Yeah, I'll take this. Give me. Oh my gosh, she almost got hit. But uh, <laughs> Momo. Oh, the next mission is behind me. Oh snap. Well, I'll see you guys in the next video. This is IKC signing out. And don't let me remind you guys, my whip game is vicious. Peace. Oops. Did I do that? Yeah. This is Siri. Thank you for watching and be sure to like this video.
For more videos from this particular mode click more videos. If you want to see more content from IKC click subscribe. Oh and don't forget to follow IKC on Twitter and to like his Facebook page. This is Siri signing out. Peace.